This is Randy Thompson coming to you live with Susan Faulkner, Evans, and Bo. And what we're doing is we're going really deep today. We want to untangle some of his last remaining cobwebs in his mind. We're working on our canter transitions. He likes to have her disconnect with the rain, as you can see. So our goal will be to get him to do canter, trots, or whatever, and to stay connected. Good. Check his jaw. See if he's soft on both sides. First step, check the jaw. Good. So since he had that reaction, you might have to ask lighter. Because we're going to try to find out where his point is of going and in, falling into that trap door where he shuts down. Again, there's nothing you can do right or wrong right now. You're just going to find out where is it that you feel his stuff come up. Right. Good. That's all right. That's all right. That's all right. Bo has a tendency to go behind the aids. You can see this is some of his old stuff coming up. And we're sharing it with you because your horse might have this tendency too. You notice he right away he gets you to let the reins go totally loose. So you'll be able to work more on that. Soften him on the inside rein. So his shoulders come in. See if you can get him to stretch on it a little bit. Now as you come down to your next gate, you're going to think half halt with your inside rein leg, half halt. And you're going to do half halts into your downward counting from five, four. That's it. Good, good. What did you feel happen in that transition? That's right, it wasn't as clear as it could have been, but that's all right, because now you're feeling, like you can feel where he disconnects a little bit. Again, he's not being bad. We're asking him for a whole different level of connection now. And in that process, he's gonna make a lot of mistakes. We want him to make a lot of mistakes. That way we can untangle everything. Good. Did you plan that one? No. Oh, he's just showing you he can do it on his own. Good. That's it. Lots of changes of direction so you can keep his little mind busy. Because you can feel he's trying to outthink you. See, he's already, he was already ready to turn, wasn't he? Good, good. Get him to stretch on one of the rein ends or the other. Feel which side he starts locking up on and see if you can get him to stretch just a little bit more. Good. Now imagine that wave you're watching when you're watching Darian in the aqua tread. Feel like there's a wave in this canter and you'll feel the wave doesn't always go through on one side. Can you feel it? Which side does he lock up a little bit on? On your left? Probably, yeah. I don't know. You raised your left hand. You were just switching your whip. <laughs> so you'll find it'll be one hand more than the other that's going to be doing it. So now just feel. Can you keep an even feel on both reins and just play with it because we're taking him back. Praise him. Good. Four, yep, listen to my aids. That's it. That's him going into a new balance. Right there is where he's trying to figure it out. Praise him. Good. So even though he felt he was kind of in, in a not so good space, he picked you up in the right space. So he really doesn't know where he should be right now. We've changed his balance again. Every time you change a horse's balance, they go through this type. Good. That was nice. How did that feel? Check his jaw. Oh, good! You're feeling it. He goes on autopilot. He's no longer allowed autopilot. That's it. So you want to check every step, like now, every other step. Now, now, now. You're going to keep doing little half halts or whatever to make sure he's loose. Now, now. She's doing her half halt when his inside hind leg is off the ground. He's in a counter canter right now. Good, good. Praise him. And then when you're ready, you're going to prepare him for a trot. That's it. Keep him. Keep your leg on. That's it. You can feel he drops you out just a little bit, but that's all right. That's what you wanted to feel. It's just a second in time, but that's that's a big second. Good trot. Ask him for a little stretch. Good. How did that feel? That was good. Much better with his head. He's not dropping it down the same way like he was doing for a while. Very good, boy.